Just saw some first flashes from the south over there. Headed towards our location. And is that thunder in distance? I'm not sure. Several flashes per minute, I've already seen one lightning bolt, but it was not on camera. I'm sure there'll be plenty more though. It was in the exact place um, I've got the camera focused on right now. And there's another flash. Oh my word, I'm not sure if that was on the frame of the lens there, but that was huge. Rain can't be far away. Oh, here's the rain.
Biggest jet, I think. Had that little, um... that the whole place lit up. I don't know whether it's passed over us or not yet. I think it still hasn't. Once it has, we'll go to the other side of the, uh, the building. Um, the reason this storm, <laughs> listen to that, uh, more pronounced than usual, I mean here in the UK it's Snoresville, nothing goes on, but we get the odd rumble of thunder sometimes, but the weather we've been having recently, very, very warm, almost record heat for the time of year. At a high today of 32.1 Celsius, 89.8 degrees Fahrenheit, bearing in mind the average high is around 69 in July. So, I think that's all part of the reason why this storm is more extreme than what we're used to, though I do understand that it's not much compared to some other places, but for here at least it's uh, quite a spectacle and it doesn't happen very often. Rainfall not particularly intense. I actually felt an onrush of cold air after that strike. Don't know whether there's any physics involved in that, but. Now it's getting harder. <laughs>
the rainfall not as dramatic as I thought it would be. This storm popped up out of nowhere, around 20 miles from HQ, and this was about 10 minutes before it arrived, if not let, my gosh. There's another one. I think I'm going to move to the other side very soon and take a look in the northern skies. This is looking south. Storms passing over us sort of in a north north easterly direction. So we're moving off towards that way. Still more lightning behind this initial storm. very rare to see lightning flashes of this intensity and of this frequency here. I've not seen anything like it for, well, <laughs> since I've been taking an interest in weather, which is several years. I do expect we've probably had conditions like this though in the hot summers of 2006 and 03. I think it's directly over us now. And here's the heaviest rain, sounds, well, much like applause in a way, isn't it? Oh, I didn't think, oh, the flash, wow, big one there, about three in the course of one second. Just off to our left now. I'm going to move to the uh, the other side. I'm going to make this quick. <laughs> Don't want to miss anything. Wow, this is another rainfall now. Let's stay for another minute actually. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm going to dash now to the other. Ooh. Just off to our right over there, let me get this window closed. Over on this side. A view towards the northeast. Look at all these blinds out of the way. Oh. starting to get some spray from rain falling onto surfaces half a metre below me. It's a crescendo. Not sure what you can see down there, but oh gosh, and the worse to look. Uh, the temperature has fallen from 23, it was cooling down anyway, to 21 Celsius, low 70s Fahrenheit. just happening in the direction I'm looking as well it's happening on my left all directions right now wow in a moment. I don't think the rain was quite as torrential as our last real storm, June 10th, 2014. There's so few that <laughs> you can remember the dates. We only had two thunderstorms in the whole of 2014. We usually have more heavy rain events and wind events from extra tropical storms. Indeed, we had two ex tropical storms, Bertha and Gonzalo, last year that affected the UK and HQ. Bertha was the worst. And the storms going off into the northeast skies, and I think our skies here are clearing a little bit, certainly over off to the left hand side where it's sort of a murky shade of blue because it has gone past sunset by about half an hour. Uh, I think this is me signing off because I've got to do a live show sharpish. I'm just um Distracted by all the thunderstorms going on outside, it's uh, it is rather distracting. Do they? 
Uh, yes, is that why you were hiding behind your little friend at the start of the show? No, just because you were worried about the... Just because you were worried about the storm here and the potential that I'll get struck by lightning if I film it. Right. 